Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, good evening. Good evening, teacher. <laughs> How are you today? Mm, I'm happy. Oh, why are you happy? Uh, we got I see you again. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay, thank you so much. Um, welcome to Five One Talk. My name is Teacher J.D. Shelton. All right, so are you ready for our class, Harry? Yes. Okay, so today um, we are going to talk about vocabulary, okay? In this lesson, you are going to learn six new words. Where, pair, ago, buy, fashion, and comfortable. Okay, so are you ready? Yes. Okay, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, so here, let's answer the question. Where do women like to go shopping? Mm, in the supermarket, in the shop, and in the... Uh, they like um, they like um, go shopping at... Mm. Okay, so women like to go shopping in the supermarket, clothes shop, and shoe shop. Okay, how about your mom? Does she love um, Does she love shopping? Yes. Oh. Do you go with her when she goes shopping? No. No. <laughs> All right, so great job, hurry. Okay, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, so here, um, now I am wearing a t-shirt, okay? So I am wearing a t-shirt. All right, so now, what is Lily wearing? Mm, she is wearing... A, a dress, a, a, a t shirt, and a, and a sh And a jeans, right? Yes. Okay. All right. So now she is wearing a t shirt. Okay. So now say where. Where. All right. Say where. Where. Okay, great job. So now, the past form of where is war. Okay, look at the spelling. Look at the spelling. W-E-A-R. And the past form of where is war. W-O-R-E. Okay, please remember that. Okay, so now, what did you wear yesterday? Um, what clothes did I get? Uh-huh. What did you wear yesterday? She wore a dress yesterday. How about you? What did you wear yesterday? Um, uh, I, uh, I wear, um, what did you wear yesterday? Say, I wore, uh, I wore a t-shirt yesterday. Yes, I wore a t-shirt yesterday. Okay, very good. All right, so now let's look at the pictures. Okay, look at number one. What is she wearing? Mm. What, what is she wearing? She is, she is wearing a dress. Okay, very good. That's correct. How about number two? 
What is he wearing? He is wearing the t shirt. Okay, he is wearing a shirt. Okay, but now how about number three? What is she wearing? Or what are they wearing? Um, they wear a, a shirt. Skirts, skirts. Okay, very good. They are wearing skirts. Okay, very good. Great job, Harry. Okay, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, so here. She went to a shoe shop because she wanted to buy some shoes. Okay, so what did she buy? What did she buy? She bought a new shoe. Okay, very good. She bought some shoes. Okay, so now say buy. 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 Okay, the past form of buy is bought. Bought. Buy. Bought. Okay, very good. So now, what did she buy? She bought a new shoe. Okay, she bought a pair of shoes. Okay, very good. So now say pair. Pair. A pair. She bought a pair of shoes. Okay, very good. So what else did she buy? She number one. Look at number she one. Also Bought gloves. Okay, very good. She bought a pair of gloves. Gl okay, very good. How about number two? What did she buy? Mm. She um, bought a uh, scissors. Okay, she bought a pair of scissors. Okay, how about number three? What did she buy? She bought a pair of glasses. Okay, very good. Great job. How about number four? What did she buy? She bought a pair of socks. Okay, very good. And number five, what else did she buy? She bought a... She bought a pair of chopsticks. Okay, great job. She bought a pair of chopsticks. Very good. Great job, Harry. Because of that, you got your first magic star. Okay, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, here. It's 8 o'clock now. Lily bought the shoes at 7. All right, so now when did she buy the shoes? She bought shoes in the one hour ago. Okay, very good. She bought them one hour ago. Okay, say ago. 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 All right, so now it's October 25th. Okay, look at the calendar. The blue circle shows two weeks ago, this one. Okay, so the blue circle shows two weeks ago. All right, and number three, it's June now. What month was it two months? What month was it two months ago? Okay, it's June now. So what April. month? April. Okay, very good. It's April. Very good. How about number four? It's 2016 now. How um what year was it three years ago? Hello. Hello? Hello. Okay, so now um it's 2006 now. 
What year was it three years ago? Six. Number four, look at number four. It's 2016 now. What year was it three years ago? It's 2000 or 2013. Okay, it's 2013. Okay, so do you understand? Yeah, uh, yes. Okay. All right, great. So now let's go to the next thing. Okay, so here, look at the girl. Her clothes are very beautiful. And her clothes are very popular this year. We can say her clothes are in fashion. And she is in fashion. Okay, say fashion. Say fashion. Okay, can you read this word? Fashion. 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 Okay. fashion. Very good. So now look at these shoes. Okay, these shoes are very popular this year. They are in fashion. All right, so they are in fashion. All right, so now. These shoes are not in fashion. They are, okay, so now this is in fashion and this is out of fashion, okay? So these shoes are not in fashion. They are out of fashion. Okay, so now, which pair is in fashion? Or out of fashion. Look at this um shoes. Okay, look at this. One, two, three, four. There are four pairs of shoes. Okay, so which pair is in fashion? This, this, this two is in fashion. Okay, how about which pair is out of fashion? The other, the other two ones. Okay, three. Okay, this is out of fashion. All right, very good, great job. Number three and number four is out of fashion. Very good, great job, Harry. All right, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, look at the picture. The shoes are uncomfortable. Okay, say uncomfortable. Okay, can you read this thought? Can you please read this word? Okay. Uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. Okay, very good. Great job. So now, un means not. Okay? Un means not. Uncomfortable means not comfortable. Okay, so now let's fill in the blank. The blank. Okay? Comfortable. Okay. Uncomfortable, happy, okay, so here is comfortable, uncomfortable, happy, what is your answer? I'm happy. All right, very good, and happy. Healthy, healthy, unhealthy, 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 very good, lucky, lucky, unlucky, unlucky, very good, so it means not happy, not healthy, not lucky, okay, so now, Let's look at the four pictures. Okay, this one. Which pair is uncomfortable? Which pair is uncomfortable? Picture one, picture two, picture three, or picture four? One, two, three. 
Okay, very good. They are uncomfortable. Okay, very good. Great job, Harry. Because of that, you got your second magic star. Okay, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, so here, let's read each word in your mom's or dad's voice, okay? Okay, for example, a go. A go. Okay, please read the words. A go. Uh huh, what else? Fashion. Fashion. Uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. A pair of. A pair of. Out of fashion. Out of fashion. Where? Where? Buy. Buy. Pair. Pair. Comfortable. Comfortable. In fashion. In fashion. Okay, very good. Great job, Harry. <laughs> very good, Harry. Because of that, you got your third magic star. All Thank right. <laughs> okay, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, look at the pictures and say the words. Okay, number one is, are the shoes uncomfortable? I mean, are the shoes comfortable? Number one is, what is the word? Uncomfortable. Okay, very good. Uncomfortable. How about number two? Fashion. The, okay, in fashion. All right, the girl dress is very popular. So we can say the dress is in fashion. Okay, how about number three? A girl. Okay, very good. So it's eight now. When was seven o'clock? It one hour ago. Very good. How about number four? Bye. Buy. Very good. What does the man want to do? He wants to buy. Okay, how about number five? What is he wearing? Comfortable. Okay, this is the word that we have here is wear. He wears a t-shirt or a short. Okay, number six. What's this? Um, chopsticks. A pair of chopsticks. Okay, this is a pair of chopsticks. All right, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, so here let's match the words with the correct pictures. Okay, for example, this is uncomfortable. How about number two? Mm. Bye. Bye. Very good. Please draw a line. Okay, Five number shit. three. Okay, very good. Number four. Patch pair. Pair. Very good. Number five. Where? Okay, number six is a go. A go. Very good. Great job, Harry. Because of that, you got your fourth magic star <laughs> okay so now let's go to the next page okay let's complete each word by choosing the correct letters okay so now the shoes are the first picture the shoes are which letters are pronounced full this uh, uh this this and this okay very good and comfortable fashion uh -huh. okay. where okay very good great job all right so the first picture the missing words i mean missing letters are f o r F O R D and then A B L E. Okay, four 
able or com uncomfortable. Okay, next is wear. W-E-A-R. Very good. And next is fashion. F-A-S-H-I-O-N. And the last one is fair. P E. I mean P A I R. I -R. Pair. There we go. Great job, Harry. Okay, because of that, you got your fair magic star. All right. So now I want you to choose one word and make a sentence. Okay, please choose one word and make a sentence. Okay, for example, uncomfortable. The shoes is very uncomfortable. Okay, so now I want you to choose a word and then make a sentence. This clothes is very uncomfortable. Okay, very good. This clothes is very uncomfortable. How about pair? Can you make a sentence using the word pair? Uh, I have a pair. I have a pair of shoes. Wow, very good. That's correct. I have a pair of shoes. Great job, Harry. All right, so now let's go to the next page. Okay, so here, make sentences with the following words. For example, ago. I went to the park two days ago. All right, so how about number one, uncomfortable. The shoes is very uncomfortable. Okay, very good. How about number two? Pair. Um, this pair, uh, dear, this is a pair of glasses. Very good. It's a pair of glasses. Number three, fashion. The shoes is in fashion. Very good. And number four, wear. Hmm, the so girl is wear a dress. Okay, she, the girl is wearing a dress. Okay, and number five, buy. And um, the girl buys a bag. Okay, so buy a bag or she bought a bag. Okay. All right, very good. Great job, Harry. Okay, so, and that ends our lesson for this evening. Okay, so. Um, do you have any question? Do you have any um, question? Yes. What is your question? Teacher, do you, do you like uh, watching movies? Yes, I like watching movies. Um, I like um, horror movies. How about you? Do you like watching movies? Yes. Wow, what kind of movies do you like? I like the five movies. Oh wow! All right, so um, have you watched a movie today? Mm, yes, yes. What movie? What is the title of the movie? Mm. Um, I. I can't, uh, I can't remember in English, but I can see it in Chinese. Oh, can you type it so I can watch it later? Because I am planning to watch a movie later after our class. Can you type the title? So okay. I, can, I can know the title. Is it an English movie? Mm, yes. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, please type the title of the movie. Okay. Can you see? Oh, wait. Um, it is Avengers 3. Oh, the Infinity War. Is this the Infinity War? Um, what? 
It says they wait up. Um, Avenger three. What is it about? Um, there is a superhero, a lot of superheroes, like Captain America, Iron Man, right? Is it it? Avenger three. Oh, so this is the one, Avenger three. Avenger three. Oh. Yes. Who who is your favorite superhero? Who is your favorite superhero? Do you like Iron Man or what? Who is your favorite superhero in the Avengers? Yes. Do you like um Captain America or who? Who is your favorite? Mm, yeah. Oh, so, all right. So, yes. Um, thank you so much for sharing your ideas. Thank you so much, um, Harry. Okay, so that's incredible. Being your teacher is my honor. You did a fantastic job in your lesson. Okay, congratulations, Harry. You got five major stars. Improving fluency in English speaking is one of the obstacles for you to overcome. Okay, try listening not just to what the words mean, but to how the person says them, okay? Okay. Okay, so thank you so much, Sherry, for your time and for your cooperation. Thank you so much for choosing me as your teacher. I am teacher James Shelton, and thank you for choosing five, one, talk. Bye for now, Harry, and have a great night. See you okay. tomorrow. <laughs>